Anybody else try that bad diet of drinking only love potions? <laughs> it wasn't working for me. And I finally looked at the label on the filter. Breakfast blend. <laughs> I was like, well, that explains why I haven't slimmed and I'm still so full of abomination. <laughs> Here's another true story. Once at an underground party in Vegas held by an actual wizard who poses as a stage magician, I was chatting with a Catholic priest over elixirs and amuse-goo. <coughs> he asked me whether Pope Honorius III actually wrote that infamous grimoire of necromancy. Well, thanks for asking and my kind of small talk. <laughs> but what do you say? that magic was the ritual cutting edge of science in the 1000s and that popes back then were wickedly erudite and had the power to cancel their own excommunications by rival popes <laughs> mid amuse bouche <laughs> do you say that the grimoire was more likely penned by anti-pope honorius ii who never relinquished his claim to the papal chair issued bulls to the day he died and likely harbored some ill will and a quill when, when your voice is starting to get hoarse. In the end, I just muttered, yes. Because here's the way I look at it. If something's been attributed to you for a millennium and counting, it's yours. That's why I'm attaching my name to pretty much everything I encounter. If any of those attributions stick for a millennium, I'm golden. <laughs> What's that? How was the party otherwise? Let's just say it was a slow burn. And some of you know what I'm talking about, am I right? <laughs>